Hello uh, everyone, uh, welcome back to uh, New River Korea People Toys uh, YouTube channel and today uh, we, we are going to build or make up a, 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 a big uh, garage uh, for the Mini Cooper here so uh, before that I'm going to tell you about this Mini Cooper the, the, the big doors Tito so this one is the Mini Cooper uh, from Koyo Show uh, scale on 118 and it's really a nice detail you can open the the board at uh, engine uh, compartment in front you can see the engine compartment and two doors open and the back door is open as well and the scale is 118 uh, a bit pricey though but really really good uh, for uh, for uh, collection and this one here it's been uh, customized uh, is it's actually from the it's a Purago uh, 118 uh, I changed the wheel and then uh, I love it it look uh, lower and uh, do some detail on the engine as well and I put the stickers uh, 37 uh, you guys know all 37 is is the the most popular uh, uh, Mini Cooper classics uh, uh, rally uh, uh, in Monte Carlo so the other one here is the classic uh, 118 from uh, Moto Max uh, not much detail, but it's still good and got a engine in, in blue. I probably had to change a little bit. I probably gonna paint it on yellow color. So I'm gonna show you the garage that I'm gonna make over. Say I built this garage about uh, a year ago. So I just was thinking um, do it new color and uh, do a little bit different. I'm gonna walk you guys uh, to the uh, garage our garage and I'll show you uh, what actually I'm going to change it all right so okay yeah this is the garage uh, that I built uh, uh, last year and uh, you know it looks uh, all right with uh, uh, I put a light LED and um, it's using a, a battery pack but uh, it doesn't really uh, bright and then uh, I got her a new, I found, I found a cheap uh, LED uh, strip that uh, using electricity and uh, let me plug in now. this is the LED strip and uh, let me turn it on and it's more bright and then you know it's good price as well so is look at that so I'm gonna place this light under here so um, it make more sense and then uh, the other thing that I'm gonna change, so I may actually have a plan. Imagine that. So this is the this is the plan uh, that I'm gonna change the whole garage. Uh, this is uh, like a awning or like a, a corrugate uh, a roof. Uh, I'm gonna, that one I'm gonna place over here and. The way I'm gonna do it is uh, using um, using a skewer and ice cream stick. You have no idea. You you guys no idea how uh, much ice cream I have to eat to get uh, to get the <laughs> to get the amount that I want. <laughs> no, I'm only messing. So you can buy this in the hobby shop or. Uh, or in the pound shop or you know you know a set, um, really cheap euro shop uh, as we call it in Ireland so and then the other one is uh, a skewer so I, I taped that all together so I can cut them uh, straight and the size that I want so I'm gonna place that over there uh, look perfect and then um, the other part of this one uh, the, the other part of this one as, as you can see, this this is two uh, uh, panel door. Uh, I'm gonna simulate uh, using a uh, to the door simulate uh, using the uh, the styrene here and a couple of uh, styrene sheet and a styrene stick. And the other one is uh, have you seen this one? Uh, this is like a block on the wall. So I'm gonna do the block over here. I'm gonna change color to brown, and the other color I still haven't decided yet. So this is gonna be. Uh, uh, time consuming. I uh, probably got uh, you know three four hours or uh, maybe maybe more. We'll see. So um, as you can see, the garage here and uh, they got the stickers, really good sticker. I'm gonna I take off 
all the sticker, take out all the part and you know and start uh priming primer spray with primer first and then uh, uh we go from there and doing the block over here and there's a lot of things to do and um, i'm looking forward to finish this uh, project so if you guys uh, please uh, stay with me and enjoy the video So, okay, uh, the level of the first wall, uh, the bottom wall is uh, done. This is the left and, uh, left and right uh, the side of the wall here. And what I do with it is I primer it and start marking uh, <clears throat> with the pens and ruler uh, during the block. And then after that, I uh, using the solder pen uh, to make the like a 3D uh, finish and as you can see it's the surface is not evenly that's the way uh, I, want, I want it to be that's like a rear block so what I'm going to do now just uh, wash a little bit with paint uh, try to um, to do a uh, uh, white paint a little bit uh, on the line here and then the rest is in the light brown so we're going to start doing it now so So like on a pin, so we can then get a little bit uh, white in there. I don't think I need to all of it, but uh, just want a little bit white in the line there. So. I'm using a, a acrylic uh, water-based paint. It's uh, easy. You can wipe them before they dry. So as you can see, you got a little bit white there. On the line there. That's 
just the one I want. I just want a little bit, uh, not all of it, I suppose. Over here a little bit, over here, over here. Don't start white gold before they dry. the wall look uh, so uh, clean a uh, little bit rough uh, on the paint side wall as well this is acrylic uh, water based uh, uh, paint so uh, it won't do harm to your arm to your hand sorry no arm <laughs> funny Luri I'm gonna wipe them up. And I suppose I'll let them dry a little bit before I start applying the dark color. It won't take it won't take that long though. No. Now I'm gonna <coughs> mix uh, a brown paint, brown color. This is a water base as well, uh, acrylic paint uh, to do the make the color on the wall a little bit brown if I can squeeze them out it doesn't look like you want to go out uh. Yeah, so we just white like that. I probably need more brown, so yeah, maybe I get a little bit of dark brown. Here. And the color is changing, which is good. Yeah, that's the way I want it. Before that, I better tap in this this side there, so I don't want a brown to go over there. one first Mm. 
Mm. Let me try it for a while. Then I can apply a little bit more. Because I don't want the, the brown to look evenly, even the same color. I want it a little bit dark and a bit, you know, a bit light color. So I'm gonna try this with a little bit of really dark color. Like I said, I don't want the color, the same color in the wall, it's like an evenly, so that is my, uh, <coughs> my plan anyway. Get the color like, yeah, more like that. I think I'm happy with that, but uh, I just think I need to be need to be a bit more dark. Let me try a little bit of black. Oh, 
that's the way I like it. Oh, that's really cool so uh i'm done that one so next one i'm gonna try uh, to trace back uh, all the blocks there <coughs> probably using a a white again and um, uh, we'll see after that so um that's it i'm gonna let it dry and uh we're going back to a time lapse okay so okay, we're back uh, again. Um, I before we go to time lapse, I just want to show you guys this. Um, I don't think I need to trace uh, on the block there. As you can see, you can see the block clearly. It's really uh, visible. So uh, I like to way uh, to way uh, how the paint uh, actually do the job over there. So I just leave it like that. So uh, the next. Thing that I have to do is the the second uh, second layer of the wall that I plan to do. Uh, that's a second layer for the wall. <coughs> now, what I have? What's my plan? That so I'm gonna show you guys. So this is the first wall. This is the second wall, and. Uh, Before I do the, that's the plan there. Before I do the garage door here, is actually located over here. I'm going to do uh, this one first. Um, corrugate, uh, corrugate, uh, simulate uh, on here, and then after that, doing uh, this like a a pull or something. Uh, well, uh, how do we call it? I know I don't really sure the name of it, but uh, yeah, you you get it, you get it. What I'm saying. So um, I'm gonna start doing this first, and then uh, we'll see. Uh, we'll see uh, how we how we turn out. Uh, this we got. I'm going to use the uh, ice cream uh, steak and a skewer on here, and then uh, maybe. Uh, Paint in the silver color, uh, make a pop, and that's all I can tell you for now. And then uh, keep watching the video I'm doing on the time lapse.
guys, we finally uh, finished uh, Diorama Garaka 118 <clears throat> 118 scale uh, Mini Cooper God, it took me the whole day, I thought it was going to take me a couple hours uh, You know, between uh, lunch break, between uh, tea, between the, you know Stretch, stretch my uh, shoulder and uh, well, it's, it's quite happy, very very happy uh, uh, project and uh, I love it and then uh, hope uh, you guys uh, enjoy the video and um, the roof that I was telling earlier to do the what I call that uh, to do the simulate the uh, simulate the roof on the wall here is actually uh, a perfect really turn out really really perfect I, I, I really really happy about it you know well you can buy a sheet of corrugated uh, roof but gonna cost you more and they're probably a bit smaller so this one I make a big and then now it's nice to display over there so end of this video I'm gonna put a, a video uh, to go through the garage so you can see a, a bit of detail there uh, as well so uh, until uh, until uh, the next bill uh, the next project I hope you guys enjoy the video and please click like and sus subscribe uh, my uh, uh, New Riba Korea Big Boy Toys channel. So until uh, we meet again, um, like a Richard Rowland said, Woo! Get you some of that. Uh, yeah, one more thing. T assistant! Yeah, T assistant. Just like Richard Rowland. Where is she? Is she coming? Is she coming? Is she coming? Do you assist them? Too bad. <laughs> well, get you some of that. Until we meet again. Uh, so please uh, subscribe uh, my channel. And this actually T here. And uh, bye bye.